Let's see that again. I'm just gonna rewind it. We're gonna watch that again. Low fastball, middle plate, fucking gone. Straight away center field, about 4.30. <laughs> uh, here we go. Oh my god, we are dumb. We are so fucking dumb. <laughs> Speaking of dumb. Actually, I did this one more time. Let's just stock up here while we're here. We don't have to worry about it later. That's good. You cats. Hey, good morning, Math Girl. How you doing? This is the worst idea I've had in a long time. Yeah. <laughs> I got up early. I, I went to bed a little early last night, so when my wife got up to leave for work, I just I couldn't get back to bed and I sat there and I pet my cat for a bit and it's like fuck it, I'm just gonna get up. So here I am racing stupid things when I'm not fully awake. Yeah, I, I'm just... I've been racing more Final Fantasy lately than Zelda. Um, it's just, I know there's no chance of a Zelda or a Final Fantasy race going up this time in the morning. It's not gonna happen. So... Thankfully, uh... Boyne is just as addicted as I am, so... So here we are!
Yeah, I, I'm, I'm gonna... I'm gonna take some time and, uh... Actually do some real prep for... The fall tourney. There's so many little things that I need to just get down. Oh, it is. It, I, it's my favorite. It, it, it's... It's still my favorite. The, the thing is, is that, um... It makes a good casual format. It does not make a good tournament format. We, we, I think we've... De that's been discussed several times. There's just too much variance to make it a good, you know, tournament format. I don't think they'll ever do it again. Oh, unless, well, I, I shouldn't say that. You know, Sandy is a mode in the new, uh, that's going to be coming up in the, the fall. And I guarantee when I've got the options to choose it, I'm going to choose it. So. But with all the, uh, with all of the, uh, um, the different modes that are going to be in that one. Um, so it's a, the, what they're going to do for the fall, it starts in October, is you can choose one of, one of various modes. So it's a best of three. Yeah, there's qualifiers and all that too, but it's best of three. You choose, the player one chooses, uh, the modes for the first, player two chooses the mode for the second. And then three is at random. Um, and it's, you can choose between open and standard, and you can choose retro or key sanity or a couple other things. Um, there's a whole bunch of different settings for it. It's You'd have to look at the... Um, yeah, you'd have to look at the Discord link. I think there's, you can also, there's like, it's hard mode and normal mode and swordless and shit like that. So, every race is going to be a little bit different. And the players choose, except for the third, which is at random, so. Um, it's on the Discord in the, uh, in the announcements. Yeah, I, the qualifiers start in October. Get away from my phone. Kitten. Oh, you know I didn't check the, uh... Oh, buddy. Are you mad at me because I didn't let you drink my water? Oh, I love you. But yeah, I've just got so many little things that I've been learning, needing to get down that I just haven't. Yeah, it's only 96 players max in the uh, in the the group stages. It's just this 512 was just too big. It was just too goddamn big. Way too many players. So yeah, they're gonna be doing qualifiers and then cut to top 96. That's gonna be tough. That's gonna be tough. But yeah, just 250, uh, two, yeah, five, or, yeah, 512 was just too many people. You can't expect, well, we're gonna, we're actually gonna follow this. Uh, you just can't expect the admins to manage that many users. It's just too many. I don't blame them. Oh yeah, you know, you never know, it might happen again. Oh shit. Oh, that happens. <laughs> Look at that. Ah, I hate doing it from here. Alright, we're just gonna... Oh wait, actually... <laughs> Good morning, Buzz Buzz. Go get him. Go get him, Buzz Buzz. I wouldn't be shocked to see that happen again at some point. But, um, I, I actually kind of prefer the smaller ones just because there's just way too much going on elsewhere, so. Yeah, it's a lot. It's a ton of work. And they're volunteers. It's not like they're really get. I mean, I, I know that they do get, you know, there is money that comes in, but it's not like... It's, it's not like they're getting what's worth their time, so... 
finish this off in case I have to do or something. So it'll be interesting. It'll be. I, I actually like the way that they're doing this one. When um, uh, Boyne and I did the uh, the two v two tournament, you know, this past what was it? This over the winter, I think. It was in the winter. And um, that was a ton of fun with all the random modes. So, yeah, I'm totally looking forward. Yeah, I mean, they that, that don't need to be. It's, it's, it's a business. You know, they do it. I don't. I couldn't get. I couldn't care less. It's free for us. So fuck. You know, I give a I give a monthly sub to the uh, to the Speed Gaming channel, and uh, I've donated a couple of times for the uh, server costs for the SRL site. If I see that they're getting close to the end of the month and they haven't made their money, I usually top it off. Cause I mean, hell, it's I've been doing this shit for a year now, and it's, it's fucking free for us, so. Mind giving a little bit of it back. Well, this book is looking like a bad option. Because there's only one item available for us here. I couldn't tell you. I, I, I. Not only do I not have any idea, I honestly just don't. Yeah, it, it's exactly. It's like. I don't, I don't know, and honestly, I, I honestly don't care. Alright, well, the book was wrong. Unless the boots are out here somewhere. I should probably check that shovel spot. I'm gonna check that shovel spot. It's too delicious not to... Not to check early. Again, it's a it, it's a it's a business and it's a service that we basically get for free. So they're putting in so many hours on making this happen. It's just like if, whatever they get. Great, go for it, man. So glad I did that. So glad I did that. That was totally worth it. <laughs> it's six twelve in the morning. I'm gonna be up all night. Like I know I'm. I'm already pulling an all nighter tonight. Because today is the WoW release, so I'm gonna start streaming around 4:30ish today, and I'm just gonna stream all night, just casually. I'm not even, I'm not even expecting people to show up. I'm just gonna have it on because I usually do the WoW grind to, to the to the new level cap, and we'll be doing that tonight. Um, I'm gonna be so goddamn exhausted. I've got a six pack of five hour energy right behind me on the play, and I'm gonna take at least one or two of those tonight. So, it is going to be a long night. I'm going to be up for probably 36 hours straight. And then Wednesday, I have an all-day meeting with a, with a work client on Wednesday. I'm going to be so exhausted, it's ridiculous. I cannot wait. These next three days are going to be stupid. <laughs> I didn't miss something like Eastern Big Key down at Ice Rod Cave following that book. It'd be really bad. That's ridiculous. How do you do that? That that's you can't do that. I mean, you, you live. Oops. Yeah, I look what I was doing there. I mean, that's I. I, I mean. You just lose. I mean, you're gonna lose. You're gonna black out at that point. So 
you're just gonna black out. And you're gonna lose huge tracks of time. I mean, I've done, you know, two a couple of times. And then, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, and you're gonna be, your sleep schedule is gonna be so screwed up for like a week. Body is not meant for that. Definitely not meant for that. I really hope I didn't miss. Oh, it was one of those situations, I got you. Yeah, I've been there too, but not for five days for a for day, I'm sure. And I've had situations like that where you don't sleep for a night or two. But five, five's a touch much. Sounds, uh, that sounds absolutely atrocious. It sounds fucking horrible. Damn it. Ugh, I'm just off. Again, not ex. Shit. Well, there's only two places left to go. my beauty sleep whenever I can get it, but at my old age, sometimes it's difficult. Yeah, I, I remember, I, I do know that the last time that I did a two-day, which I, I, I've only done it a couple of times, and I was young, I, mean, I was really young, um, along that second day, I just, again, I just started blacking out, and I just started losing tracks of time. Yeah, I just started like, oh, hey, look at this. It's, you know, five minutes just went by. I have no idea what happened to the time. So, yeah, I can't imagine anything longer than that. Yeah. Can't do that these days. It's for damn sure. Um, I'm definitely going to take a power nap at some point to, uh, tomorrow morning. Probably after I level cap. I'll take a three-hour power nap or two, three-hour power nap or something like that. I've learned to appreciate sleep, let's put it that way. die yet. Oh, jeez. <laughs> that doesn't sound good at all. Well, yeah, again, at that point, you're just gonna, you're just, I mean, you're gonna lose tracks of time, though. Your, your brain can't, your brain can't cope with that. It's not designed to. Brain needs sleep. That's, that's why we have to sleep. Brain needs to, to cope and repair itself. Brain, you, okay, 
Okay. I, maybe it's different for people, for everybody. Shit. Yeah. Interesting. No idea. I have no idea. <laughs> If I understand how the brain worked, I probably would not be sitting here at 6 in the morning racing Zelda. Ah, oh, I gotcha. Pod key. Maybe Eastern key. Para key. Moon Pearl. Okay. Pod key. Para key. Moon Pearl. Um, with this setup, let's go... Yeah, let's do North Route. <laughs> I guess that's normal. I guess so. I don't think hallucinating is ever normal, but you're probably right. You're probably right. It is probably part of the deal there. certain is I I appreciate sleep. I definitely appreciate it. And uh, I miss it sometimes, especially when I'm up this early. So I usually get to bed really late, and last night I, I got to bed a little bit uh, earlier than normal. I don't have any maps? Seriously? I get to bed. I went to bed at 10 last night, which is really early for me, and... Uh, so yeah, when my wife's alarm goes off at four, I'm awake. Here I am. <laughs> if I can squeeze a power nap in today, I'll actually do it. Small key, small. Okay, can't use it yet. Important key. Uh, why does this have to be on today? On WoW release day, I get up early. Go to sleep then! Oh my god, go to sleep! Don't sit here and watch me, I'm not fucking worth it. Go to sleep! <laughs> Are you sure as fuck ain't worth being up for... I'm just gonna sit here and sleepwalk through this shit, so... You know, I was—I think that was crystal music. I honestly wasn't even paying attention. I stopped paying attention a long time ago because in 
you know, and key sanity doesn't matter. I think that was crystal music, if I recall, but honestly, I just stopped paying attention to them because in open standard, you know what's there, and a key sanity doesn't matter. Great. Oh, I hate it when there's a key up there. Yeah, I, I just honestly was not paying any attention to it. <clears throat> yeah, that makes sense. <clears throat> but yeah, I honestly was not paying any attention. I think it was crystal music. Crystal music is the more upbeat. And then the, the pennant music is the slow, slow roll. Just, just out of curiosity, because I haven't been paying a ton of attention. Um, key the thieves. That's interesting. Um, how is the, um, how has the uh, the Wind Waker stuff been going? I know that I, I don't really pay much attention to Discord anymore since I, I, uh, I don't handle the tracking stuff anymore. Um, although I've been tempted to go back and play another one of those. That was fun actually when I did it. It's just time consuming. Yeah. I, I actually did. I really enjoyed it when I did it. I just... Six hours, six, seven hours for a rando is just too much. It's just too much. I need it to be under two, otherwise my brain starts to melt. Yeah, I know that the... Uh, uh, the dude that took over my, my, my source code and actually made those, um... Oh! Oh, that's right! You guys are doing them on Monday now! I did see that! Three five keys. I saw that you guys are trying to do dailies, or trying to do weeklies on Monday. I did see that. I remember that. I was actually interested. I was thinking about it. Um, maybe, I, maybe I'll pull that off on one of these Mondays, just for giggles. I'm gonna be awful. But maybe I'll pull that off. I do remember that. That sounds like, that actually does sound like a lot of fun. I just obviously I can't do it this way. Um, are you going to be doing it every Monday? Oh, very cool. Wednesdays, okay. I, I'm gonna I'm gonna have to remember that. I'd like to actually try to squeeze one of those in. I really would. It, it was again, I really enjoyed it. I just I'm not good at it. But it was a lot of fun. Wind Waker's a really good game. I I, I Wind Waker is one of those those games that kinda gets a bum rap for what it's for what it's there for. But um, it really is a fun game. I think I'll try. I think I'll try to sneak one in at some point, just for the giggles. Hopefully, hopefully it can take off a little bit. I know it's at that point right now where it can, you know, where the, um, you know, people are actually people know it exists. Let's put it that way, and that's good. Gotcha. So it's so. It, Hopefully it tries to keep it down under five or whatever. What it, what kind of flags are running right now? I mean, obviously you got to do dungeons, and there's probably a few others that are really easy um, that are not like horribly complex. Pod based off what we're seeing. I'm going to by the bomb shop here when I'm leaving. Fairies, puzzles, short side quests, free gifts, misc. Yeah, that, that that sounds about right. 
yeah, you're gonna have, you know, a decent amount of progression. It's still gonna take somebody like me, you know, six, seven hours to do it, but... GT key. Turtle Rock key. GT key, Turtle Rock key, and Bubbles. Still not anything important here. Again, I, if you guys are gonna start doing those on um, on Wednesdays, I'm gonna I'll see if I can't swing one in at some point, just for fun. Para and Scorpions. Okay. Oh shit! I thought I had more capacity than that. <laughs> I just spent uh, 100 gold on two bombs, or 100 rupees on two bombs. Still in four hours. Okay. Yeah, four hours might not be enough. The the problem the thing is, is that you have to do dungeons. Like dungeons is required. You know, you have to do otherwise it's just a glorified triforce hunt. You have to do dungeons. And I mean Great Fairies, there's only a few of those, so that's not a big deal. Um you know, sub-quests are pretty important. I'm actually going to grab this map. It's probably going to be the map of Skull Blades. We're just going to grab that out. But I, I think the trick of that is finding it where it's not too easy, but not too hard. Uh, yeah, I, I leave that up to the experts, because I am no idea. Yeah, miscellaneous is so weird because there's a lot of, like, half the miscellaneous are really, really short and really easy, and I think are really important, and then the other half of miscellaneous is, are really long and drawn out. It's like half and half on that. You know, you've got, like, oh, the chest that's just sitting there. Oh, look at that. It's just a random chest that takes 30 seconds to get. And then you've also got, like, the chest that take you can't get until half. Yeah, exactly. And then there's a lot of sailing. So, good luck with that. <laughs> good luck with that. I don't know how exactly you're going to make that work. I'll try to, you know what, if you're going to... I can't watch tonight, that's for sure. Because I'm going to be uh, playing WoW all night. Um, I got to open the front door. Got to open the front door here. Can't not do this. So it means we're going to have to find at least five keys. But um, I'll keep an eye out. This sounds like fun. Side quests and gifts. I, I agreed. Agreed. Those, again, they just, they seem too important. Too important and too simple to remove. We'll do this. We're going to check the front because the way logic works in here. Chin. I went to bed too early last night, man. I went to bed too early, and, uh, yeah, and then I just couldn't get back to sleep, and I woke up. Yo, Gil. <clears throat> Good morning to you, too, sir. <clears throat> now, I, honestly, though, I, I really, I'm, I, so torn on the Wind Waker stuff because it is fun. It, the, when I did it that, that day, that was a ton of fun. I really enjoyed it. Um, at the same time, I had no idea what the hell I was doing. And it just took forever. Ah, there we go. 
I knew there was something in here. I knew there would be something. I, and here's the thing. I have no time to commit to learning Wind Waker. Ooh, that's the boots! We's got some boots. We's got some boots. Set this room now, unfortunately. <laughs> She's at work, man. Shen, she she goes to she goes to work. She's already working right now. She leaves it. She's the one that does. Oh, going from the top is much easier. But I'm having to do this without a sword guide, so. goes off at 4, and then she actually gets out of bed at, um, she actually gets up to leave for work, uh, at 5, 5.30, something like that. That's why I'm awake. Her alarm wakes me up sometimes, especially when I get to bed a little bit earlier than expected. I haven't even been to Death Mountain yet. Let's check Bonk Rocks, and let's actually open up Death Mountain. Yeah, that's why I'm away. <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah, she just has an early... She works from, like, 6.30 to 3 is her, her time, her hours. Hmm, thank you. She's a, um, she's a uh, quality inspector. Her company makes magnets, and she does the, uh, the quality inspection at the end of the line. Yeah, she already, she just sent me an email like 10 minutes ago. She's already at work. She's already up and running, so... If I'm up at this hour, there's only two reasons why. One, my wife's alarm went off and I got up and got back to bed. Yeah, go to go to sleep, math girl. You gotta be you, you're gonna be busy in six hours. Go to sleep. <laughs> Good luck and have fun with that. Too. Everybody's up. Holy shit. What's everybody doing awake? I'm actually going to grab this. That's an interesting item right here. Um, I'm actually going to get this because it opens up Spike Cave to Logic. And I'm going to do that. All right, you two. We'll talk to you later. I'm actually going to do Spike Cave while we're here. Oh, we are almost out of magic, though. We don't have a magic refill here. You know what? I'll do that later. Alright, um, we'll go here. Oh, dude! Gil! Awesome, dude! Oh, God, I'm glad they finally got... Oh, God, now, now, now I have to do mine, right? I kind of gave up already. It's like I already gave up. <laughs> if I if I get the time to do it, Mathaker, I definitely will. Because I actually wouldn't mind modifying mine a little bit. Um, to make mine a little bit easier. Because <clears throat> I would like to an, an actual off with five. I just haven't done it yet. God damn it, Gil. Now I gotta do it. I didn't want to. Eastern. No, 
easier. Um, I think I did this a little bit out of order, because I still have that damn ice rod cave down there. I think I want to check it. It's kind of scary leaving that the way I did. And once I do this once, I'm not coming back. So yeah, let's do that. We're going to get ice rod cave out of the way. Oh, what's a desert? Desert's crystal. do that, yeah. I, I gotta find the time for it, but absolutely I'd be up for that. That sounds like fun. Again, I enjoyed it. I'm just no good. I'm not good. <laughs> I have no idea what the hell I'm doing. Wow. I missed a sword here. Ugh. That's a small mishap, don't you think? <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be... I'm gonna have a hard time finding time in the next few weeks. Just because I am gonna be busy with WoW because of the expansion coming out. I do have some shit I need to get set up. Um, but, um, yeah, I'm definitely up for it. Finding time is gonna be difficult. Uh, we also have our... We're going to be doing league matches for the next month. But yes, please, stay on me about it, because otherwise I'll forget. And... Oh my god. Oh, I screwed this up royally. Alright, thanks. Get some sleep. Oh, there's a second sword. Jesus. All right, well, we got two swords out of this. And I got to punch a Zora in the face. It's amazing. We still actually, we have a Master Sword and we have no access to actually give to those, uh... Pod. We do not know Pod. Oh, how many items did I leave in the I, I, that's not correct. Uh, yes, I am going to be streaming my, my WoW, um, uh, I'll be streaming the, yeah, I'll be, I'll be streaming all night. Um, I don't expect really anybody to show up, uh, but if you guys are around and just want to see me shoot the shit and be delirious because I'm going to be on no sleep, um, and high on five hour energies that are sitting in the thing behind me, um, yeah, you guys are more than welcome. We'll be, we'll be streaming it as, you know, as long as we can, and, uh, We'll just see, yeah. It'll be 100% casual. I, I do, usually I'm one of the, um, you know, I'm usually really fast at doing the initial level to 120. I'm usually one of the first, in our, at least on our guild, if not server, to get there. Um, but uh, beyond that, it's kind of one of those, just having fun. That was an intentional bomb, by the way. I wanted that many. We'll definitely be doing it. We'll be on about 4.30 Central is when we're going to come online. And then, uh, because often the expansion actually uh, kicks off a little bit early. It's quite it's quite common for the expansion to kick off early, so. So I'm thinking the mirror or the hook is going to be around here somewhere because I'm looking at this and I'm seeing Crystal 5.6s being available here. So I wouldn't be shocked to find either the, the uh, mirror or uh, hook somewhere very, very soon. Actually, there's not many spots left to check, so... Well, she'll be playing too, but she's going to be off to my side. Um, we're on different factions. I'm Horde, she's Alliance. We're on the same server. Um, what's funny is that we're both gonna be... We're both gonna have War Mode active. Why did I do this first? Oh my god, that's why I did this first. Okay. I said the mirror was gonna be here somewhere. Um, 
we're up, but we're on uh, we're on opposing factions. It'd be funny if we come up across each other. Because we're gonna have war mode on. I'm actually gonna conserve the magic here. We are still in green mail. Who knows what can happen here with Mothula? So, Shin, here's the... Okay, yes and no. Um... Uh, yeah, it's yes and no. Um, we, we, we still are, but we aren't. Um, so I left... I'm still GM of our Alliance Guild. I'm still the GM of our alliance uh, guild. Um, it's kind of dead, though. I left it when I went Horde, and um, I did it for raiding purposes. Because our, um, our server on... Uh, it, our server is horde dominated when it comes to uh, when it comes to raiding, and our my raiding guild that I'm in we've been server we've been top on server for the last four years. But we're not going to be this year though. Uh, we're actually we tone things back with our raiding schedule. Um, we were normally you know we would do heroic for the first week and we go straight to mythic. Once we once we get a once we get a full clear, we're actually pulling that back this week. We got burned out this last expansion big time. We never even so I stopped raiding um, before the last uh, the last raid tier came out. I just got totally burned out. Um, and the other guys that were in our our raiding guild uh, did not finish a hundred percent mythic on the last raid. I think we got like nine of eleven, and everybody just got burned out. So we cut things back a bit this year. Which is exactly what I was looking for. Because I just don't have it in me to do it anymore. Oh, shit, I dropped that too high. Damn it. Yeah, there it's group uh the raids are for group done for group instances. Uh groups of ten to thirty. And then mythic rating is twenty. Eh, I'm one of those that I, I appreciate it. I am however gonna I am gonna mirror block this, I think. Unless I got to did I get there? No. I'm out of the mid, so I actually have to lose my here. Or at least go around. Should I check catfish while I'm here? Actually, you know what, that's a really good check. I think catfish here is a really good check, just because Um we don't have a t we don't have a t opportunity to go do this. We've already cleared Zora. We'll do that, and we can save quick, and then head up to uh, head up back up to uh, Death Mountain. That works. So yeah, we'll keep this. It's a pretty easy check. It's just down the road here. So, I'll probably, in the end, actually, I'll probably stream the, uh, um, our rating progression, too. Although, again, we're not doing Mythics this season. We might, we might change our tone. It depends how it goes. As it stands right now, we're gonna do things really light. We're gonna cut things down. We're gonna cut our rating time basically in half. So, we're only rating six hours a week. Um... And we're only going to do heroic rating until we decide kind of what we're going to do. I think we both are to an extent. Um, T-Rockets 3. 
uh, I think we're both excited to an extent. Um, we have we have very different styles of playing the game. It's kind of one of the reasons why we we don't play much together. Um, she's kind of a she's kind of more of an completionist on the. Ex I know I had that. That was weird. So my sword was locked. That's really weird. I didn't trigger. Um, she's more of a completionist and an achievement uh, and stuff like that, and I'm more of the rating side. She doesn't really do much for rating, so... Um, she's in a guild that was doing some, some casual rating, but that was it. So yeah, it's just, we just have different play styles, and that's good, that's what's good about a game like that, is, you know, the different play styles is not, you know, everybody has a different, everyone's kind of got their own thing, so. Yeah, I'm actually more excited about this one for two reasons. One, I know I don't have to worry about playing 30 hours a fucking week, like I was doing before. Um, and two, I... I didn't, for the first time in a long time, I didn't play much of the beta. <clears throat> Usually, I, I almost always get beta access. Key to Thieves, interesting. Oops. And I, I purposely went out of my way not to play the beta this time. I only played for like five hours. And I was like, you know what? I'm just going to stop. <clears throat> so... <clears throat> excuse me. <clears throat> So yeah, now without without that, it's just like I don't have to worry about it. Yeah, well between we would raid between um uh, we would raid between nine and fifteen hours a week, depending on where we were at, and then the rest was prep. I mean you have to prep. So you have to do grinding and shit like that. So I would be playing, you know, 20, 30. At the beginning of the expansion, 30 hours maybe was low. Maybe it was even closer to 40. And then it tones down a little bit. One of these. See, this is. This is what I'm talking about. Before the fall tourney, I need to, to get these little tricks down. I don't do this bomb jump because I failed it before, and I hate failing it, so... Um, I do it the long way. I can, I can get all those little nuances and just get down and do it. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hmm, that crap in my throat. Anyway, um... And I think that's why I'm a little bit more interested this time around. It's just I don't have to worry about the I don't have to worry about the big things. So is Fat Fairy. Now, I know Boyne. And Boyne knows... Like, it's just me and Boyne playing this. Nobody else is stupid enough to play it this time of morning. Um, <clears throat> I know I know Boyne, and Boyne knows my play style. He knows I'm going to check Fat Fairy. It's not that I can't do it. Um, okay, here's the deal, Shin. It's not that it's not that I can't do the hair jump. The hair jump's not a big deal. The thing is, if you fail the bomb jump in pod, you lose five seconds. You fail the bomb jump in Harry, you lose a minute. That's a big difference. So that's why I don't do it. Until I'm hundred percent comfortable with doing it that way, I just don't do it. Because I'm not going to lose a minute. You lose a literal minute. I actually timed it. It is a full literal minute you lose. <clears throat> it's not worth it. 
you're 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 losing you're trying to, you're gambling a minute or i'm sorry you're gambling um yeah i'm sorry you're gambling a minute to potentially save 50 sec or to save 10 seconds because it takes 10 seconds to do it the other way the way you're supposed to do it i never i still haven't set my i think i'm at five because i have five left in there um it's just not worth it in my opinion <laughs> <clears throat> until I'm until I'm 100% comfortable, I'm gonna nail it 100% of the time. I'm just not gonna do that. The key to desert. We have desert. We have desert. We have thieves town. Oh, I know, and I know what it is, and Catabat. I know exactly the spin strat. I know exactly what it is. Um, absolutely. I just, until I'm a hundred percent confident, and I just haven't practiced it. It's all practice. That's all it is. Because I haven't done the practice, I just don't want to do it. I know this is a crystal, I just didn't mark it. That's why we're gonna do. That's why we're doing desert before we do swamp. Well, I do not know what swamp is. Plus, we can turn this book in. Oh, you know what though? I should have gone around and done the other because the other king is still there. Actually, no. Book's not a dud. Book, book still actually is important. It gets me in here. I'm still personally, personally I'm missing something. What am I missing? Yeah. No. Absolutely, Cato. Um, how long did I do the the pod the the hammer yump? Took me maybe a half an hour. <laughs> I mean, that was it. And then I had to relearn it. I did have to relearn it once when I um when I got the the NT the Super NT as my setup because the pixels changed a little bit on my monitor. Um, so I had to relearn it after I did that. So I had to learn it twice. But yeah, that one only took me like ten minutes. I just had to relearn where the pixel location was um, because it's lower on my screen. Castle Towers. Ooh, that's a tricky one. <clears throat> if that, I mean, it was it was really easy. You just have to learn where the pixel is, is all. And then again, then I had to learn it. I had to relearn it. So it's not difficult. None of these are difficult. The I'm sure the Hera jump will take even less. I just haven't done it because I'm lazy. I'm lazy. I admit it. I'm cool with that. I'm totally cool with it. I'm lazy, man. I admit it proudly. Yeah, I, I honestly, that is the only the only issue that I have with it. Is sometimes I can nail it on the first, and then sometimes, yeah, I have to buffer it a few times. And, like on this one here, I had to buffer it a few times. <clears throat> but I also didn't have a sword when I was doing it either. It made it a little bit more difficult. That's the first time I think I've actually done it with the um, without a sword. It was interesting, actually. Yeah, yeah. It, again, it didn't take very long. It wasn't a, um, it wasn't a big deal. It's just once, once you learn it, you're, it's, it's, it's riding a bike. Once you learn it, you can have it. It's done. Maybe I should have done these time first because I can save a little bit of time. If like there's vanilla mints or something there. Get a four goes under. Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, she knows I'm racing. I sent her a text this morning. She knows. Swamp Palace is very tempting, but we're gonna do Thieves Town first because then we can loop it. We can loop this around, and uh, I think I'm actually gonna do Fat Fairy before I do Thieves uh, before I do uh, Swamp Palace. So we'll do we'll do this first. Um, we'll do the South Route, which checks the uh, uh, the the Grove uh, the Grove Chest. Um, oh, we got Oh, when we're done with this too, we have to do. Uh, we'll do Batman before we leave. And then we'll go over, we'll do Fat Fairy, and then I think we'll, we'll loop back around and do so. I think that makes sense. I have one hour to finish this seed, because i got to work at 8. And today's going to be a busy day, because... I'm already going to be a little short today. I have to st I have to step away for about an hour today, and I actually have to run to the store. I need uh, snacky stuff for the for the the overnighter, and uh, so I got to step out for an hour. So that was a bad bonk. Um, so I really can't be late working today. Um, I mean, there's, um, there's gonna be a, uh, what is it? I'm trying to remember what all, I mean, there's a bunch of new zones, of course. I mean, it's, it's pretty standard, um, left, or left. the, the difference on, oh, Jesus Christ, come on, you fuck. God, they're being dicks this morning. Jesus Christ. Um, the difference on this one is that the um, there's no new classes or races. Uh, they're doing the um, allied races thing, which is a little bit different. Um, which is not a, it's not required by any stretch, but it's just kind of it's it's interesting content. So. Um, there'll be, there'll be three or four raids as always, you know, there's, what, seven dungeons, something like that. There's my pie. That's the one I was looking for. Um, it's just, you know, I mean, it, it looks like it's kind of par for the course. Um, this one is PvP focused, I think is the way that they're doing it. They're doing the whole, you know, rehashing Horde versus Alliance shit, so... I think it's more on more based story based than content based on this one, which is fine. huge into PvP or anything, um, but I am going to be leveling with PvP only. There's no reason in the early game uh, of this expansion not to have PvP turned on. You get 10% increase on your uh, experience and on world quest stuff, and then um, uh, your, your faction's not even going to be there. The opposing faction is not even going to be in the starting zones. So for the first, you know, four or five levels, it's completely safe. Actually, she was PvPing over the weekend a lot. Which was a little surprising for me, because she doesn't really enjoy PvP, but she was actually doing it this weekend. She was having fun with it. I can't explain. I don't really enjoy it either. <laughs> We'll see. Again, I purposely went out of my way not to play a lot of the beta 
because I didn't want, um, I just, I didn't want to spoil this one. I was it because I, I usually get in the early waves of the maiden lights. I usually do. I, I don't know why. It's not like I'm anything special. Or anything. But I usually get in early. I'm usually in some one of the first waves, usually every year. And um, yeah, on this one I was, was no exception. I just didn't play as much. I decided to to lay off it. <laughs> she actually was, yeah, oh man, what, uh, she was doing one of the battlegrounds, I think it was a Rathy Basin, and she was, she was yelling at people, like, what are you doing? Come back! It's funny. I was actually in the kitchen doing dishes, and, uh, all I could hear is like, what are you doing? Come back here! Don't leave! It's funny. Okay. Well, that seems important. I think that's the first time I've gotten anything good off Batman in a long, long, long time. Oh, well, this is gonna... We're gonna change this up just a hair, aren't we? Um... Okay. Well... We're gonna check the whole damn thing now, aren't we? Where's my hammer? Fuck me. <laughs> it happens, man. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, it's... I, again, I just don't... I don't do anything organized, so PvP is stressful. It's, it's very stressful when you don't have any coordination. I, I don't, re again, I don't recall the last time Batman actually had anything good. It's been a while. I think now you actually just go straight to Swamp. I don't think I'm going to do, like, I'll turn this in. I guess I'm going to be right there. I might as well go into Swamp. We don't know, we're, we don't actually have a lot of maps this seed. So, there's five dungeons left and only, we know three of them are crystals. We just don't know what's what. Ooh, loony, loony, loony. That's horrible. That's worst case scenario. Well, okay, Gil, really good example of this. If you remember back the, uh, um, uh, was it Panda Land? Yeah, it was Panda. It was Mr. Pandaria. The, um, uh, that expansion had the legendary had required PvP. You had to do for the legendary cloak. And so you're forced to do it, which really sucked. I'm gonna get this. And that sucked. I hated that. I really did. But you had to do it. And then you had a bunch of people that were just doing Battlegrounds just to get the cheat. They had no idea what they were doing. Um, hell, I was one of them. Because I don't do Battlegrounds. Rarely do I do Battlegrounds. Um, but yeah, that was one of those scenarios where it's like, oh, well, I have to do it. And then it just, yeah, it makes it so that it's not very fun because you generally will lose. <laughs> oh man, I'm still on cloud nine over that match. Dude, I, I went back and watched it. I went back and watched it. I got so fucking lucky that that key item that was my 10th key item I there's no way I win that match if that 10th key item is not at uh, Dwarf Castle there's no way it doesn't happen I'm gonna be behind by three minutes
I mean, I didn't need to use Coffin Strats. I could have jumped with Kane. Um, Coffin was just a little bit quicker. Um, not by much, a little bit. Um, jumping with Kane was maybe five seconds slower for everyone, and I had to do what? I only had to do like 15 sirens, so... You know, that's a minute and a half or something like that. You know, a minute, minute and a half that's gonna add to it. Um, so... It, it, it had no, it, Coffin's, Coffin Strats was, was the, a little bit of a, of a gain, but the fact that I found that 10th key item was everything. It just so happened that I needed five bosses, and Ordeals and Dwarf Castle is five bosses. It's perfect. And they were both key items. So, everything just came, just worked out perfectly on that. And now we get a week off to do the, um, before we do the next one. Yeah. Oh, no, no, I agree. No, it was, it was definitely faster. It was definitely faster. No doubt about it. Um, I'm just not sure that it was the, it, 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 again, it wasn't the coffin part of it that was faster. It was the, uh, it was the 10 key item. Because he had like a three or four minute head start on it. for a second. What do I need? What do I need for go mode? Ah, I guess the problem is I don't know what I need for go mode. Um, minimum, I need one, two, three, four, five items for go mode, I'm going to say. So let's check left side. We'll just check left side. From here. Yeah, he was using Quake and Virus and shit for, for all that. Absolutely, yeah. So it was, again, absolutely. It was, it was definitely faster. Was, uh, dude, I was on cloud nine after that one. That's such a huge win to start because now I know I only need six points, maybe. I think 10 is going to be probably the cut line. Uh, maybe 11. But now I know what I need. It gives you double experience. So I had to do half. The 10th key item get, is when you get the double experience. So he was getting 34,000 experience per sire, per uh, egg, I was getting uh, 68. So I had to do half of that. Oh, hey, Schmitty, thanks for the host. I need to put up the, um, I have a new uh, alert I need to put up for hosts. Um, I know what it's going to be, I just haven't, I haven't, I haven't totally finished it yet. I just need to, uh, I need to extract it. I, I've already found it. I just have to extract it and put it in there. You guys are going to laugh your titties off. No, it really doesn't. It doesn't. The thing is, if it was a K1 seed, yes. The problem with a K2 seed is that you don't know, um, you, you don't know if the, the spots you're going to check actually have key items. So, I, I mean, I could have gotten, like, a, you know, a Gungir Spear and a Glass Helm from those two spots. I just got lucky that they were both key items. <laughs> yeah, I, um, I won't spoil when I put that in, though, but I've been meaning to put a host alert on there, because I do get a... I do get hosts from time to time, there, and you guys need a uh, a nice little alert for that. I just haven't uh, I haven't extracted it yet. All right, so we're gonna do this. We're gonna do Fat Fairy. Uh, we should probably do Ice Palace, but I do want to get the Fat Fairy check in. I hope it's not like swamp big or something like that. That would suck. Because that'd be a spot I don't think they're going to check. Wow, swamp has been a complete dud. And we don't know if this is a crystal or a pendant either. This could be a pendant. <laughs> oh my god, it's been a complete dud. Yeah, no, I still think that's a bad play. 
Um, there's two reasons to check Mount Ardeals, and those two reasons are Cecil and Tella. That's it. Um, if you don't have Cecil or Tella in your group, and you and you want, or if you don't want to turn, you know, there's there are times and places you don't want to turn Cecil. If you want to keep him as a Dark Knight for his agility, um, you you just don't go to Ordeals. There's no reason to. Not set up well for this one. Gotta be careful, I'm in green now. These, each one of these does two hearts. I do have a red view of my maps so if need to use it, but I just don't want to I mean the um, one of the races yesterday ordeals was the money hunt the money spot too, so um, but no, I still think that's a bad choice. I still think it's a bad choice. Unless this is a key to fucking oh it's oh god. Well, we know that's a dud. We don't need Aga. Aga's not required for anything, so that's a dud. That was a 100% dud, except for the crystal. It was required. Yeah, okay, so the reason you want to keep Dark Knight Cecil is for his for his agility. Um, he's got he's got lower than normal agility, and as long as you don't level him really high, um, his agility is is going to be it, it is is control. The other thing you can do with Dark Knight Cecil is if you want to turn him right at the end, you can turn Dark Knight Cecil as you're finishing. Like, I'm ready to go to Zeramis, and I have Dark Knight Cecil in my group. Then I'll go do Mount Ordeals very quickly to turn him. Now I have a one agility, uh, one agility Cecil. And that's perfect. If you can't get Cecil to 14 or 28, get him at one. You get him as low as you can, and you get extra turns. Yep. Schmitty's exact. That, that's it. That's, that's the argument in the nutshell right there. If you don't have a good weapon for him, there really isn't a reason to turn. And that's exactly the reason, right there. So we'll keep a pot. Oh Jesus, that's pot, that's key six. You don't need that. That's, not, that's really disappointing, actually. Um, oh, we're going to be torn here. Because <clears throat> I've got six items up on t up on Death Mountain. I can actually get into... Get in there as well. I'm not sure how to do this. He comes less whiny. <laughs> he is pretty mopey. I'll give you that. He is pretty mopey. Especially in the DS remake, where you get his voice acting, and you get to hear him. Yeah, he's pretty mopey. Wow. Yeah, he's uh, he's a real stud there. That's his um his his dark ability, which is uh, basically meaningless. It, it, I I don't think I've ever used it in the um um at least in the random. I don't think I've ever once used it when it's when when J two is live. The remake, um, the one they put out for, I'm going to say the PSP, that one is a little bit different. Um, they actually, they made it a little bit decent, if I remember correctly. It's not horrible. I think it was the DS remake they did that.
Yeah, it's horrible. Was it good in the DS remake? I can't. Re I couldn't remember if it was good in the DS remake or if it was just the PSP version. I need to check and see if I have any more maps. I still don't know four dungeons. Two of them are pendants, two of them are crystals. And I don't want to do a T-Rock dive here. I don't. Shit. Oh, no, I have pod. I know pod. Okay, good. That's That means we need to find the bow. Well, that's actually important. That's good to know. Was it okay? It was the DS remake. I haven't played the DS remake in a long time. I own it. I own four copies of the fucking game. Like I own four little literal copies of Final Fantasy IV. And unfortunately, the one I gave up is the best one. I don't have the copy of the original SNES, the Final Fantasy II card. Oh, Schmitty, I saw that. I saw that post. I actually I downloaded that Excel. That's a that's an insane piece of information, dude. I will be using. Hey, you big thanks, dude. Much appreciated, man. That was a uh, that was a hell of a race. Had a lot of fun. We were, we were kind of chatting about it earlier. Man, this is just a, oh, there we go. Big key to skull ones. Now that was that's really disappointing. What do we do here? Do we go into you know what? Let's go to T Rock. There's five items we can get. Um, we don't know what this is yet. Um, let's go get the five. We have everything we need to get this. Plus we can actually get all the way over to Mimic Cave. What am I missing right now? I'm why do I feel like I missed something? Huh? I feel like I missed something. Um, Cecil's Black Sword is surprisingly good. It's surprisingly good if you can find it in the early game. Um, I will always, I will never take the time to equip anything to Cecil when he's in Dark Knight, except for the Black Sword. Um, it actually does a decent amount of damage. I think it's like a 34 attack power or something like that when, you, when you've got it equipped in the early games. And, um... And it's got the, obviously, the, the, the auto death, so... Um, it's quite healthy. Oh, I missed this one. have chosen wisely. I still don't want to go to, uh, it's like I still don't want to go over to, uh, to Pod. It's not the big key. Yet. No, I agree. I, and I I usually keep those Medusa arrows nearby. I don't I try not to sell them. Um I try not to sell them when I find them because uh, there are a lot of good bosses that they're that they are strong against. Um you can also use them on the uh, the egg grind. If you um if you decide to use them on uh, uh if you decide to use them on the egg grind, you can you can sometimes get the, the instant death on those too. I can still do items in Turlock. I most certainly cannot. Huh. Interesting. 
that's a bug in my code. How has that not been caught by now? Jesus Christ. Interesting. I will have to fix that, because that is most certainly a bug. I gotta remember this scenario. Let's go do... What are we gonna do here? Let's go do ice. We have the, uh... We have Bombos here for ice, so it's not like it's a... Uh, we don't have to worry about the magic mostly too much. That's a huge proc rate. I, I suspect that there's a back end, um, a, a defense coefficient that goes into effect with that. Um, because obviously the eggs have no defense. So that's, I, I suspect there's something to that. We're really hopeful that this is a crystal. Because that means we don't have to do Meyer. Um, we don't have to do uh, T Rock. Which means we also don't have to find the Ice Rod. Which means, unless that big key. This is going to be interesting. We do need to find the cake. Probably, because there's a big key sitting on the. Uh, but, I mean, the, the chances are this is not a crystal, but, again, it's difficult to say. What the fuck? Oh, shit. What the hell did that happen? Fucking kidding me? Are you fucking kidding me? Die already? What the hell happened there? Uh, we're not gonna bomb jump this. We have the cane. We have the big key. We don't need the bomb jump. I don't think I've ever fucked that up. Before. I don't think I've ever fucked that up. So it's a third percentage every time you hit with that shot. So late game Artemis Bow, you get to It makes sense. It definitely makes sense. Alright, so here's... Okay, let's figure this out. If... If... This is a... That means all we need is the big key to pod and the big key to GT. If this is a crystal. If it's not, you know, all bets are off. At least we'll know where it is because there's Meyer map. So we're going to know after this, after we finish Cold Stair and we leave, we're going to know what, uh, what we need. So that's good. At least we're going to have our information. If this is, we're down to basically just two big keys. We know that there's a big key sitting on the bumper ledge. So, God, and the put off the spike key for so long. That's a spot that concerns me, especially with we don't need more maps. Um, especially with Boyne as our opponent on this one. It's just a one v one. It's just Boyne and I doing this because we're dumb. And, well, we're dumb. That's that's the whole point there. Um, Still 
but um, so yeah, that's that's real. If this happens to be it, we're in great shape. That being said, there's still a good chance of a double. Game, so, oh, that's right. I purposely didn't bomb them. Ruby said there. Um, okay, Shin, here's the thing. Uh, Final Fantasy IV is the my it's the it's the game that got me into RPGs. And it's it's arguably my favorite game of all time. Um, everything you just said there, with, like, the agility and the procs and all that shit, I didn't know about it either until recently. You know, I played through the game, and I could play the game front and back. Hell, we did it for old school gaming. We did it for old school gaming. It was the first game that we did, and we beat it in, like, eight hours. I mean, it's, it's, it's a game, but I didn't know any of that shit either. I just played it to do it. I've learned so many more things since I've started doing random. It's ridiculous how many glitches and how many little nuances there are in that game. It's ridiculous. I love it. It's fantastic. But um, I didn't know any of this shit. Vicky Pot, Pot, Pot. That's the GT. Alright, well. Required anyway. That's okay. That's okay. We're cool with that. We're cool with that. It would have been better if it was the other baby, but hey. That means we know that as soon as we get in there, we'll go. Oh, wait, hold up. And we need the flute. Okay. So we're two items away now. It means we don't have to go back into Turtle Rock, though, which is awesome. We need the flute. But Ice Palace was required. Uh, we're gonna go turn that mushroom in. It's not a difficult check to do here. Plus, um, we might just fill up the goo while I get a chance. And then we have some interesting choices to make. It depends if we follow the bow, or if we... There's still a, two or three different characters out here that are characters, locations that we can get. Um, this will be interesting how we do this. <laughs> you just have a, a hate boner for, for Cecil. It's all good. You're not the only one, I'm sure. Oh yeah, he's got the highest potential. Um, he definitely has the highest potential. That's without question. We're gonna... Ch Again, we're, we're, we're down to three or four locations here. Oh yeah, when you get... Um, when you get... When you zerk a... With Crystal, I mean, he does 5, 6k a hit. It's ridiculously how... He is ridiculously powerful. So, basically, where we're at right now, considering nothing else was required in Ice Palace, we need to hope Blaine didn't go in there. And he found, like, oh my god, if it's, if it's in, um, if it's actually in Spike Cave, now we actually, we definitely want it to be in Spike Cave, because that'll throw him way off the scent. Let's check Spike Cave.
Uh, no, single hit is like 5 or 6k when you've got him deserved. Come on, really? Yeah. Yeah, it's... It, it, he's stupid fast. Yeah, actually, you know what? I need to I need to view that because I know what you're talking about. I actually don't know. Um, I've never done it, but I've seen it. I want to check that one out of the way first um, before we do what we're about to do. Is so we're gonna we're gonna die back into swamp. Getting that swamp key. Um, means we kind of have to do this. <laughs> because I'm not going to go back to pod. Not yet. Now it's possible this leads to nothing. Um, it's probably likely that it leads to nothing and that the item actually isn't pot, but there's only two items left in pot right now, so you might as well just do this. Oh, I'm sorry, there's three items in pod. We have the turtle room chest, but we need to finish it pod, so... The flute is going to be in one of these locations, most likely. Could also be the cape. Remember, we do need the cape. Um, if that big key that's sitting there is important, which eh, it doesn't have to be, um, but we need the big key to Meyer anyway, so. So we're going to check these and then pod is going to be the location to go. Um, so this is the, this is one of those times that diving back in small is not big deal. Um, the, the other good news is I think I'm going to be done before I have to start work, so um, I've got 23 minutes to finish, which should be fine because we're going to be able to uh, blow through GT. Although right now we're on Silver Master Sword, which is not preferred, even though we've full cleared everything. <laughs> Required, not what we needed. Not what we needed right away, but still required by some safe way here. We gotta block it anyway. Wow, so it was, definitely it was a big key check. It was a big key, uh, but it means it's gonna be important. That means pod is the check. And there are three items that are in here that we can get. The big key most, it's either a big key or flu. It has to be in one of the, in these three chests. It has to be. There's nothing else left. Oh, never mind. It could also be Cape. Fuck. It could be Cape. Maybe it was faster not to save quit and just actually run it from uh, Swamp House. Probably was. Yeah, it was. It's probably quicker doing it that way. You save a save quit. And you don't have to worry about that. Um, yeah. But we know it's got to be here. It has to be here. So there's two. There's three items that could be in here. There, is, and one of them we definitely don't want to see. Um, the big key to um, the big key to uh. uh to pod could be in here, and that's the one we want. Um, it could also be a, a big key to uh, to Eastern, which isn't as bad, but it's okay. Um, it could be the key to Turtle Rock. That's what we don't want to see. We do not want to see the key to Turtle Rock. Um, it could be the flute, which is good. It could be the uh, cape, which is okay, because it leads us to another big key. Uh, I think it's it. Yeah, I think I've named it. Uh, Shmini, this rando is is the best because it's so it's so logic intensive. Oh, we got tempered sword. Perfect. Oh, I love it, love it, love it, love it. 
gotta check the back chest. We have to check the back chest. Son of a fuck. This is gonna be a double dive into tur Turtle Rock. You know it is. It's gonna be a double dip into Pendant Turtle Rock. Well, so much for getting to work on time today. I hope I don't have a meeting today. Good look. I hope I don't have an 8 o'clock meeting. I sometimes do on Mondays. Wayne's having as much fun with this as I am. This <laughs> stats affects the weapon replaced with auto deserve slightly broken. Yes, yeah, slightly broken. <sighs> Alright, so here's how we're gonna play this. There are two two big keys left in the world. Two. If we find the cloak, we're going to leap. And we're going to take the chance that Bumper Cave is the correct big key. We're going to take the risk. So, it's a 50-50 gamble if we find the cloak in here. Um, the question's going to be if we find the loot in here. Because... Make sure I didn't have it already. <laughs> I was like, do I, I don't have a clue. We're good. Um, oh man, what a what a mess. So we can check all the way to Laser Bridge. We cannot obviously get the we cannot get the kill. We don't have the ice rod anymore. And we don't have the fourth key. There is potentially a triple dip still in this lodge, but I think it's pretty unlikely. They would need to be cave or the big key to pod on trains. So I'm not too concerned about that. <laughs> I, I do got to look at that setup. I actually, I don't know that setup. I do need to look that up. That'd be really good information to have, just in case the scenario comes up. I just, I don't know, I don't know it. There's so much shit I do not know in this game. So. Oh wait, no, 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 can't go this way, can't go this way. We gotta check the big chest, my bad, my bad, my bad. My bad. My bad. I totally forgot to check the big chest. We're not going with this. Coward. Red mail's for cowards. Oh, absolutely, Shin. Absolutely. That's uh, not even close. If you if you get a berserk with Avenger or Excalibur, absolutely you will. He'll get twenty. He'll get fifteen to twenty k per round. because I don't want to have the triple it. it's a There it is. There it is. We're probably in go. We are probably in go.
The, the problem, okay, Shin, here's the problem, is that you have to actively go through your menus and actually select all that shit. When you are, um, uh, when you, event, when you, when you berserk, you just set it and you go. You're done. And you're actively waiting on the other side. That's why berserk strats are probably the fastest, as long as you have good gear, is that you can just set it and then you just sit there. And if your agility is in the right spot where you're getting multiple hits in per, it's just gonna, always going to be faster. Um, with the Reflect, you have to keep the wall up. You have to be careful it doesn't drop. You have to go through your menu. You have to select your shit. You have pass times. You have the animations. There's a bunch of additional things that go into it. You're going to hit more per hit with Reflect strats. You're going to hit, you know, 6, 7, 8, even 9k with Reflect strats. But you got to go through all the effort. And the effort takes time. Well, there's a 50-50, this is what we need. And if it's not, I'm gonna be just furious. But there's a 50-50, this is this is our goal. And then we don't have to worry about going, we, we can go with Meyer. There be a difference between haste and berserk. Yeah, no, haste doesn't do much in this. Um, it's why nobody uses it. Um, it really doesn't do much of anything. No, nobody uses berserk or uh, haste. It just doesn't do. It doesn't do near as much to make it worthwhile. Pocky, 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 pocky. No! Ah. Oh. Come on! I got work to do today! I really hope I don't have an 8 o'clock meeting. I really hope I don't have an 8 o'clock meeting today, because I'm going to miss it. On. Big Kimi. Big Kimi one time, buddy. Big Kimi one time. No! Not a small key! <laughs> oh. oh my god! I guess I should update my shit. Oops, that's not what I wanted. Big Kimi. No! Did you know that a triple dip into T-Rock is still in the logic right now? Um, it's still in the logic. I'm really tempted to do Eastern. I really am. I'm super tempted to go do Eastern right now because there's three items in Eastern and it means we could go mode this. I'm super tempted to, but I'm not going to. I'm already here. Yo, Kevin. Yeah, I couldn't sleep again. I got up at five. the normal way. Um, do we just rush? Do we bum rush the boss? Let's bum rush the boss. Let's bum rush the boss and then we'll, um, because we have to do it anyway. We know it's a crystal, so. Um, yeah, let's bum rush the boss. We'll get the the, the, lay, the, the two over here. See if we find the pod key and then we'll, we'll, we'll clear it from the other side. Damn it. Well, we know whenever we find a key, we're in go. We know the second we find a big key, we're in go, but... God damn it. It's here, it's in Eastern, it's one or the other. I was really tempted to go to Eastern. It's quick. Um, it's probably quicker than this. Thank you. 
<laughs> Looney, nah, we'll be good, man. We'll be good. We'll be good. So there, we we still need the fourth. Uh, there still is a fourth key to uh, um, Turtle Rock too. Because we actually we would need two items to finish. Could be that, yeah. Could be that. That's that's more likely. We know the pet is dead at least, and at least we have the GT. Right here. One time, buddy. One time. One time. Help me out here. Big key. <laughs> we still might sub to this, but it's gonna be real close. It's gonna be real close. I'm not even gonna try to figure the logic out for this one. I don't think we're gonna sub to it, but I think it's gonna be really close. Because it's gonna take two minutes to get through now. We're not. We're gonna be like at a two hundred one. Because it's gonna take us at least another two minutes to get through here, and then um, another minute to climb Death Mountain. Yeah, we're gonna be like a two hundred one or something like that. Well, it means that I'm gonna be a couple minutes late for work. That's all. Could be worse. Honestly, you know what? We didn't route this too poorly. We really didn't route this too poorly. Um, considering the circumstances, we actually routed this pretty well. We, we chose correct on the majority of the spots. Um, the only thing is we didn't do... Um, we did a lot of shit, obviously, that was not required. But everyone... But, but Boyne's gonna do it, too. I mean, of course he's gonna do it, too. Um... There's not much of a god route here, considering it's a required double dip independent tier for two items on Laser Bridge. And then what was the other? The flippers, I think. What did we get? What was the flippers out of there we got early? So something like that, or oh, that was in Pod. There was something in T Rock. What was it? What was in T Rock? Was it a key? Oh, it was the bow. That's right. It was the bow. Actually, with that in mind, then you could have single dipped it because the bow did not lock anything. My bad. So actually, you could have single dipped Turtle Rock because the bow was not required until after. So yeah, I guess that's, that is a thing. But I seriously doubt anybody single dipped here. <laughs> Oh, wait! Change that. Um, there was something on the bow lock side here in Pi. Now, you could have sequence broke that, but there was something on the bow lock side. It was a big key. Wasn't it? There was a, it was Tempered Sword and a big key to something. It was the big key to Swamp. That's right, it was the big key to Swamp. It got the, uh, the Swamp chain going. Or big, I'm sorry, not Swamp, it's a Skull Woods. It got that, it got there, the swamp, and then it picked up the big key to, um, uh, what was it, to Meyer from there. So that was required. That actually was required by logic. My bad. It was required. Yeah, we're gonna be, it's gonna be like a 201. Might be a 202, but it's probably a 201. save quitting and just starting at the mountain is probably faster than oh shit well it would have been faster um 
than mirroring and fluting. Would have been faster if we hadn't fucked that up. Bunch of mediums here. This is the medium stream now. Nothing but us mediums here. So my concern right now is... We know Blaine can out-execute us. He's just better at execution than we are. Um, by a couple of minutes. So... This was effectively a full clear. So I'm a l We basically just have to hope that our routing is good enough to make up that time. Because he's going to out-execute us into GT as well. He's really good at GT. So it's possible that he could be four or five minutes ahead. Um, it's possible that we could be a minute or two ahead. I don't think any more than that. Um, but, uh, you know, if we're a couple of minutes ahead, we're probably okay. He's going to shave off 30 seconds in GT. That much is just a gift. He's gonna he's gonna be 30 seconds faster in GT than we are, unless we're just flawless. Um, he's just he his his GT execution is really fucking good. I'm jealous as shit. <laughs> we'll be done in seven minutes. We'll get a bonk game in, and then I gotta get to work. Is there any chance he didn't go into Ice Palace? I think that's the only part of this that is, you know, there's potential there is that he didn't decide, he decided not to go into Ice Palace. I would find that very hard to believe. Like, really hard to believe. Oops. Oh, shit. I have four hearts. I have a fairy, a red, and two blues, so I don't really care. Um, I think I'll just burn that red if I take a hit here. I'll wait for I have red now. In fact, I'm even going to take the extra heart here. I'm, I'm in no danger because, worst case, I'm going to have the fairy. Oh, you, oh, that was the one that, uh, you get the freebie? You mentioned that, that you might, that might happen. That kind of sucks, but, I mean, you're not in it to get free wins, but, okay, pick what you get. Come on, really? Not a bad GT. That's why we don't have to even, we can just blow by the end uh, here. We don't have to ferry or anything. And we're going to be close. 
closer to a two or three. <laughs> I felt something. I felt something on my arm, and I was like, "Is there a bug or something on my arm?" So I went to flick it away, and no, I was like, "No, Blaine's not done yet." We actually still have a chance here. It's gonna be close. I mean, there's no way he's not like right behind us or right in front of us. So again, there's probably at this point just a minute or two difference either way. Is it 8 o'clock? Oh my god, I'm gonna be late. Good thing about working from home is you're never really late. Nice triple. Good start. Ooh, this could be a triple triple. Oh, that one was just, just, just off. Let's see if we can snipe this win. Hey, big boy. Hey, big buddy. Sorry I flipped you away. I didn't know you were there. Was the Triforce in the validation chest? Should I have checked it? So a 2-0, what, we're going to be like a 2-0-2. It's actually pretty good for this type of a scene. Be two or two and change. Uh, no, that happens only in Aga 1, right? I don't think it happens in Aga 2. Right. Oh, this is going to be a good setup, too. Although we're a little screwy here, yeah, damn it. Oh, we had a good setup too. Hope that doesn't screw us. Triple me? Triple me? Sniper, no sniping. Sniper, no sniping. Sniper, no sniping. Started up. Let's see where he's at. Let's see where the dude's at. Where's Boyne at? Where is he at? Oh, he's climbing GT. So we had him by about two minutes. We had him by about two, two and a half minutes. Ugh. Yeah, we want it. Let's see, let's take a look at his tracker and see what he didn't do. The only thing I see that he did that we didn't is he found the small key to Hera somewhere. Where was the small key to Hera? The small key to Hera must have been in Mire. It had to have been in Mire. It had to have been in Mire. It's the only place it could have been. Did he? Oh, he full cleared Mire. Yeah, he full cleared Meyer. All right, let's let the credits roll and everything. I want to talk. I'm gonna chat with Boyne at the end of this really quick too. Let's turn Boyne's audio on here for a second.
Uh, Misery, my big key is last. Where was the mi Oh, that's right. That was on the big key chain. <laughs> he didn't do the key chain. That's why. Yeah, that's what it was. He didn't do the keychain. Yeah, that made that makes sense. Yeah, we checked that immediately. As soon as we got that key, we checked that keychain out. It led to a key to key to the key. We've seen that before. Oh my god, Ice Rod was in validation chest. That was so much fun. Oh, those are always fun. Um, yeah, so if, if you don't check the keychain, I could see that being a problem. So we didn't check what? We never found the... <laughs> Yo, Matt Surrey. You can get your guess in, though. We got the boots pretty early. I couldn't tell you where they were at. But we did... Oh, no, they were in... Um, it was in Pod. They were in Pod. We went to Pod pretty early. Excuse me, I'm getting my, my shit set up. There's like three people that guess 17 too, but that's good. That's good. Ties are fine. Ties are fine. Thanks, Looney. Yeah, we are gonna go live around. Um, we're gonna go live around 4:30 tonight. So that's in what eight and a half hours, and uh, we're just gonna go until we stop, and we're just gonna keep going. Again, it's gonna be it's gonna be casual. We're just gonna be doing the level grind. Um, uh, I don't expect there to be a lot of people here. If you guys show up, it's great. We'll chat. We'll shoot shoot the shit all night. Um, but um, it's gonna be it's gonna be low key. I get to check and see if I missed a meeting for work. I really hope I didn't. Awesome. It's at 8.30. I didn't miss it. It's in 20 minutes. Woo! <laughs> yeah, uh, 120 is the new level cap today. I didn't miss my meeting. It's in 20 minutes. Which means I have time to make, some, make a sandwich for breakfast, too. music never gets old. This is like the best music in any game. It never gets old. I could hear, I've heard this music literally 400 times. I'm, I'm really curious, how many official races have we done? Uh, right now the cap's 110. I'm just curious, how many Zelda races have we done in the last year officially? We have officially done 387 Zelda races in the last year. And on the side, I've done maybe 50 to 70 more. So I've done over 450 races of Zelda, and this music never gets old. It's still good. Yeah, you guys want to see my stats. Um, overall, 
um, since August 19th of 2017, so we're just at a year, I have played on just SRL time, just SRL time, four weeks, five days, and 14 hours. So out of the last year, a month of it has been SRL, has been, and that's just the SRL time. That's not counting like the time right now. That doesn't count. So like credits, pre, you know, pre-race stuff, all of that is, you know, it's all, doesn't count. Did I guess that? Did I guess that? No, Looney got it. Looney got it. Looney. Oh shit, Looney's in the lead. No, he's not tied. He's tied for the lead. But behind on tie breaks. So we have two people at two. Again, this this bonk game will be going on for another two and a half months. Um, I actually had some good bonks in that one, so even though I was fucking asleep, so. So yeah, <laughs> I'll figure that one out later. Actually, you and Dusty are both I uh, both in Europe, so you're the two in the lead right now. So, actually, Catobat's you, Catobat, you're you're European too, right? Yeah. So everybody except for my son, who's the fourth on that leaderboard, is in EU. And then the treasure game is all over the board right now. So, um, all right, boys and girls, that's gonna do it for me. I gotta get some work done. Um, again, I'm gonna be offline now for the next eight and a half hours. Uh, we'll be back on at four thirty. Um, 4.30 uh, e uh, Central Time. Oh, Blaine just finished. Um, so we'll be back in eight hours, roughly. Eight, eight and a half hours. We'll be playing some while tonight, having some fun, just kicking back. Probably drinking a little. We'll see if... We no, drinking's a bad idea. Um, so, all right, guys. Enjoy your day. We'll catch you guys in about eight hours. Have a good one.